Um, I was really pleased with the horses. I couldn't have asked more from them today. Uh, they gave their all. Uh, they felt like they were, you know, dancing on clouds. Um, I, I just couldn't be happier with them. It was a fantastic uh, view in the uh, in the arena, Chester. Uh, how did your uh, preparations uh, go for this event? You know, leading up to this event, we had a lot of luck. This team hasn't been defeated this year in dressage, and uh, so I had a lot of confidence today going into it. Boyd sort of let it, uh, laid it down at 35, and uh, uh, we took a little, bit, a little bit of risk. We changed a bit on one lead horse that we felt like uh, we could just uh, get a little bit more uh, movement out of him and push him a little bit harder, and uh, the plan played. Uh, Chester, you competed here last year, you won the test event. Can you tell us a little bit about uh, how your experience from last year gonna, you're going to use uh, tomorrow in the marathon? Well, I think that there are a couple of factors that might play uh, in the cross country. One is uh, the racetrack environment where you're constantly uh, following carriages around. You have to have the right team to do that. And some horses get really competitive following one another. Um, I think we brought the right team to do that with. And um, I, uh, you know, the ground is is uh, but is is its own thing here in Cannes. That's a, a little bit uh, different than what most of the driving competitors are used to in terms of grass. That's why I really came here last year. Um, it's absolutely the same this year as it was last year, and um, I guess everybody else is learning as they're doing as I am.